there's a secret hack that you can use to find the best potential property investment locations without spending hours on research or having any special knowledge. I call it the copycat method. It involves just two steps and I'll show you exactly how to do both of them in minutes without leaving your laptop. And we know this works because this is at the core of the method that we've used to make thousands of successful investments for our clients over the last 10 years. But you don't have to work with us because we're about to tell you how to do it yourself. Drop a stone into the middle of a pond and you'll see ripples moving outwards, eventually having an effect in areas far away from the actual point of impact. This ripple effect happens in property too, and it's a powerful way of working out where prices are likely to rise in the future. It's really simple. First, prices start growing in one area, often a city centre, driven by employment, regeneration, or some other factor like that. Because prices go up, some people who would have wanted to live there get priced out, so they move a little further out. That drives prices up in that area, which causes some people to move a little further out again, driving prices up there. And on it goes, just like ripples on a pond. The only difference is it's not just a matter of distance. Ripples tend to run along transport links because it's all about the ease of getting to that initial location. So if you know where the stone has been dropped, you can predict the path of the ripples to find out where it's going to be next in line and get in there to benefit. So how do you find out where the stone is being dropped right now? It's dead easy. Just go to hometrack.com and look at their list of 20 UK cities. This guides you away from areas that are currently struggling and unlikely to continue that way, which at the moment includes Oxford, Bristol and London. And it guides you towards areas that are doing well, like Manchester, Nottingham and Birmingham. Then it's just a case of following the ripples. You can actually see this working right now. If you look at this more detailed list of the top areas for capital growth, the top four are all receiving ripples from Manchester, which has been growing fast for several years. Then you've got Mansfield in fifth place, benefiting from the ripple from Nottingham, and Telford getting the ripple from Birmingham. And as we saw earlier, these are the three fastest growing cities right now. Great, so now you've identified the main points that the ripples will be coming from. But how do you narrow down your investment search from there? Well, luckily, there's an equally ridiculously easy way of doing that, which I'll show you right now. But first, really quickly, if you're learning something valuable from this video, please give it a like and consider subscribing to the channel. It really helps us out. In the stock market, there's a popular investing strategy called coattail investing, which is basically copying the trades of the best investors like Warren Buffett or Bill Ackman riding on their coattails and people do that on the basis that well they've got a good track record they've probably done a load of analysis and you can piggyback on that for free and you can do exactly the same thing in property but this time you're copying the big publicly listed house builders like taylor wimpy persimmon and bellway when these companies make bets they're big ones committing to schemes that are going to take years or even decades to get planning and fully build out and they've got shareholders to keep happy, so they can't leave anything to chance. So they spend millions of pounds on collecting and analysing data. They look for locations with growing populations and good demographics. They look at employment levels and local affordability. Then once they've crunched all that data, they try and find locations near good schools and transport connections. And that's very kind of them, because it means that you can then just copy them, either from Rightmove or from their own websites. For example, earlier we identified Birmingham as a city that's growing strongly, so there's likely to be a ripple outwards. So I can just go onto the Taylor Wimpy website, pop Birmingham into their search bar, and boom. These are the locations where they've already done all the research and they're building out sites now. This is great because, let's be honest, you've probably never heard of Sturchley or Shirley, and so you wouldn't have thought to invest there. But thanks to someone else's hard work, you now know that these are good investment locations with good demographics and strong fundamentals. Of course, you don't have to just buy on these sites. You can then pop the postcode into Rightmove and open up the search radius to get more of a feel for the area and see what's available for sale. In fact, one of the best investments that I've made in recent years is in Horwich, which I still couldn't particularly pinpoint on a map, if I'm being honest, but I know it's near Bolton, so it's getting a ripple from there, and that's growing strongly, and Bolton, in turn, is getting the ripple from Manchester city centre. So I've basically made that investment on exactly the same basis that I've been talking about today. The thing is, in property, there are no awards for originality, so if you can copy someone else's work, why not? And if you'd like to start doing that right now by copying our work, then you can watch this video next and find the areas that we're particularly rating right now.